Hey, what's up traders? Uh, this is Trader Tim from over at eminimind.com. Uh, and in this video, I wanted to address the uh, drawing set feature in Thinkorswim. And so a lot of times you'll see my charts that I've got, you know, multiple charts on the screen. But if I'm drawing over on the right chart, it's not showing up on the chart on the left. And it's definitely a question I get a lot is how to connect or disconnect those drawings. And so if you're on Thinkorswim, you can come down to the drawing set and you can create a new drawing set and call it whatever you want. And so I've got a couple of them set up, uh, including left and right for my left screen and my right screen. If I make the drawing sets the same, now any changes that I make on the right chart are going to show up on the left chart. And so it, at the very least, if you want multiple drawings with the same ticker symbol and you want them to be disconnected so that you don't have drawings carry over, uh, just change the name. And so you can have right and left or drawing one, drawing two. A really helpful thing you can do um, to establish all of the unfilled gaps in the market is uh, create a drawing set that's called gaps. And so this is something I just created here. And when I click that drawing set, you'll see I've got all of these lines marking the unfilled gaps from you know the last couple of months. And so this way I can come in here and I can see that tomorrow, here's today's close at uh, 0650 was uh, our close today. Well, tomorrow, if we move lower, we're pretty close to this 2787 uh, unfilled gap. And if we move higher, well, then the next gap above us is in 2869. And so if we, if we cross that level, then I can just delete that uh, price level. And, you know, I used to keep a post-it in front of me here, and uh, that was great. But when you, now that we have so many gaps above and below us, it just it became too hard to keep track of. So I created a drawing set, titled it Gaps, and then I can go back to you know my left standard drawing set, and all of those drawings stay the same. And so I can toggle between the two, and all of my gaps remain on my gap drawing set. And if I go to my left chart, then I can do my you know intraday analysis. I can change time frames, and those gap lines don't clutter up my screen. So a pretty common question I get with linking and unlinking those two charts. So if you are on Thinkorswim, uh, you can set it up in that way. And uh, it's a pretty helpful tool to be able to uh, quickly toggle through different chart setups without having you know, four monitors and, and having a, a big bulky um, multiple windows open. So this, this helps you keep your, your trading uh, screen a little bit cleaner and keeps the um, processing uh, requirements a little bit less on your computer just because you don't have you know, 10 windows open. You can just easily toggle back and forth between those, uh, those drawing sets. So if you have questions, uh, feel free to uh, leave them below. I hope everyone has a great week and I will talk to you soon.